Again, it looked a lot like Christmas at the New Mexico State Capitol. This is a tradition that started when the new Capitol was built in 1966. We're at the west end of the building right now. And ever since that time, every year, this tree, a 25 foot white fur, is lighted. You can see it's decorating the ornaments right now. But uh, between 5 30 and 6 o'clock tonight, uh, Governor Martinez and I will do the countdown. There will be some kids around, and boom, we'll put a lighting to this thing right now. Behind me, you can hear the beautiful music. Music. This is the 44th Army Band providing some Christmas music. And I know it's kind of dark out here, but we have a, a crowd gathering because there's a lot of free uh, apple, hot apple cider, I guess it is. And it would be Biscuitos, which is the New Mexico steak cookie. And in just a few minutes, we're told, I'm told that uh, Mr. and Mrs. Claus will be making a trip from the North Pole right here to the uh, Capitol building where they'll be handing out candy canes to the kids. So uh, come. At 6 o'clock, we're going to show you all this uh, video of the actual Christmas tree being lighted. But right now, let's bring you up to date on your weather for there that will be working on in. The first one Mexico, will be tomorrow in northeastern Arctic parts of New Mexico. And then as we uh, work in into some more Arctic air that will be impacting a broader part of the state, Wednesday on into Thursday. Now, look at your 12-hour planner. We'll be in the 40s, not bad for us, but we're going to wake up tomorrow with uh, temperatures around 30 degrees. And yeah, there could be a couple floors around because it's going to be overcast to start before the sunshine starts to appear. Here's a look at what we're expecting throughout the area for tomorrow. It'll be cold in the morning as we advance into the afternoon. Look at the temperatures holding out in the 30s throughout Raton on into Las Vegas. Notice not bad here in the Albuquerque area, around 50 degrees. However, as we uh, look at the following day, here's a look at Wednesday, we're going to see that cold morning with that next front that will have some modified Arctic air. What does that mean? It means it's going to be pretty cold Wednesday night on into Thursday and as that works down the eastern part of the state. So here's a look at the seven day forecast 30 tomorrow, a high of 50. Remember, clouds in the morning, a couple of showers around, but then on Wednesday it'll be breezy, a high of 43, and that cold air will start to build on in for Thursday. It'll be like a deceptive sunshine, 20 with a high of 40. And then temperatures start to moderate as we go into the weekend where we'll actually be above normal for a while. So again, you can hear the tunes from the 44th Army Band behind me. There's the big Christmas tree a few minutes from being lit. And we'll have more about that coming up at 6. Back to you, Doug.